today I'll be showing you guys a super cute purple springtime eye look that I created. Hope you enjoy it and let's just go ahead and get started. So before anything else, I had already applied the MAC Prep and Prime all over my eyelid. So my base color for this look is going to be the Wet n Wild Color Icon Eyeshadow Trio in 2 Indio I Go Go and I'll be using the crease color which is this really pretty matte purple. The brush that I'm using is from MAC's Enchanted Eve's Brush Kit. It is a 213 SE brush in it. And if you guys are curious of what products I'll be using throughout the video, I wrote them down for you guys on the description box below, so feel free to check that out. Next, using Wet n Wild's Large Eyeshadow Brush, I'm just blending out the edges so it doesn't look too harsh. As for my crease, I'll be using Makeup Revolution's Iconic 3 Redemption Eyeshadow Palette, and I'll be using the matte purple that they have within the palette. I'm just going to keep applying this to my crease with my eyes open with a pointed blending brush. This one is by MAC, it's their 266 SE brush, and I'm just going to keep applying the product until I have the color that I want. Using Wet n Wild Eyeshadow Trio in the New Romantics, I'll be using the eyelids color which is a shimmering purple, and before I apply this, I'll be spraying my brush with water and then just tapping the excess of the water on the back of my hand, and then just applying it all over my eyelids, trying to avoid the crease area. Blending out the edges, I'm using the large eyeshadow brush by Wet n Wild. Then using the same crease color, I'm going to apply this under my waterline, connecting it to my crease, and I'm just going to use my e.l.f. eyeshadow brush. I'm also just trying to keep it as close to the lash line as possible. As for the inner corners of my eyes, I'll be using the New Romantics palette and I'll be using the brow bone eyeshadow. It is this pretty shimmer ivory color and I'm going to apply it with my fingertip. To clean up the eyeshadow, I'm using Maybelline's New York Fit Me Concealer in 15 Fair, and I sort of went out of the camera there, but I'm just applying it under my eyes, which you will see in a little bit. After that, I'm blending it out with my True Beauty Makeup Applicator, and then to give it a more sharper look, I'm switching to Real Techniques Pointed Foundation Brush. Real quick, before I start applying eyeliner, I'm going to apply Wet n Wild Ultimate Brow Highlighter under my eyebrows. And the reason why I am applying a little bit is because a little bit goes a long way. Then I'm just going to blend it out with my fingertips. Then using my Jordana's Classics Eye Pencil in 28 White, I'm just going to apply this onto my waterline. And then tightline my eyes with Marc Jacobs Beauty Highliner Gel Eye Crayon Eyeliner in Black Cure. This is a sample size by the way, I got it on my birthday. With Wet n Wild Mega Liner in black, I'm just going to apply a thin line across my eyelid. Using my Beauty 360 Eyelash Curler, my Holy Grail Eyelash Curler, I'm going to curl my eyelashes before I apply mascara. For mascara, I'm using Wet n Wild's Max Fanatic Cat Eye Mascara in Black Cat. And since the fan is unique, I'm going to use the flat side first, only on the outer corners of my lashes to get that Kai eye effect. Then with the rounded side, I'm applying it to the rest of my lashes as usual. So this is the finished look. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and share it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!